Okay. Let's do this one. Offer my condolences. Hmm? Offer your condolences. Ay, eso Cristo vi. You lived under our roof. Had the decency not to treat me like some stranger you just met. I was going to call you. I prepared an ofrenda for Jaquito. We can't let him go without a proper goodbye. The ceremony will be at the Coyote Cojo. Many of his friends will be there. Say no more, Mama Wells. I'll be there. I did not doubt it for a second. Ahí te veo, Vi. Got it. <clears throat> No bad. <laughs> Hell yeah. I have my shit over it.
reporting suspicious activity in Haywood. Roger that, dispatch. This is 331 responding. This is my neighborhood. I'll take you for tacos sometime. Yep, he's following me. All units in the area, order has been restored. All units instructed to return to patrol. I would not call that restored order, but sure, I guess. better to tell you the truth what is happening that night when when jackie well let's just say things haven't exactly been easy since yo sé como te sientes todos lo sabemos i am in the middle of preparing an ofrenda there is still so much to take care of <laughs> want to take part in the ceremony but i want to do it the right way, in line with tradition. Mm-hmm. But something I'd, I'd lay by his casket that would do justice to his memory, I... I don't got anything. But your heart is in the right place, mi niña. Don't worry. He's symbolic. Look for something in his garage. His past is all there. Thanks, Mama Wells. Nah, don't mention it, V. You have respect. I admire that. The garage is on Republic. I de veo. case for people with brain Is she still talking to me? What the hell? Keep 
screaming into that void, Night City. Sooner or later, someone's gonna hear you. Until then, it's 92.9 Night FM. Ivy. You here alone? This is not exactly the safest neighborhood in town, Misty. I used to sit on the stairs when I was 10. 26 now. If anything was gonna happen, it wouldn't have taken this long. What are you doing here? Sitting and waiting. And yeah, waiting for him. Though I know he's never coming back. Lately, I've just been coming here to sit. An hour. Sometimes, too. I know it's gonk, it's just... I miss him. A lot. Wanna sit? Catch up? Hardly gonk at all. Just... Well, human. I guess. You know each other long? Half our lives. Grew up in the same streets. Saw each other a lot, but just never got together. Till you're back. Yeah. Best darn year of my life. Jack talked about you a lot. Always saying how much you meant to him. Did he really say that? I bet he used different words. <laughs> Maybe, <laughs> but... Maybe. That's what he meant. I really believe that. You actually got to know him. The real Jackie. Everybody else thought he was a goofball with a rough-hewn face and an edge. But they're wrong. Nah, Jack was... Jack was a little of that, too. Always looking on the bright side. He wore his heart on his sleeve. And wasn't at all afraid to live fully. Had his inner demons, though. Who doesn't? Exactly. They're what makes us who we really are on the inside. There's a huge chunk of his past in there. How come you're outside? I don't have the key. Jackie never gave you a set? You two didn't get that far. He offered, but I wanted him to have his own space. Just his own. Mama Wells is having a send-off for Jackie. I need to find something he really cared about. Mind giving me a hand? I'm not sure I should go in there, V. Still too soon. No, it's not that. Mama Wells and I aren't exactly on the best terms. She wouldn't want me touching any of his things, disturbing the memory. That I know. Jackie'd want you here. That's more important. Come on. Fine piece of metal and mechanics. Yeah. He was so psyched. For whom the bell tolls, Ernest Hemingway. Jack read it a dozen times. Always right before a big job. He said the guy who wrote it was tougher than Morgan Blackhand. You read it? Is it any good? I... I never got the chance. It'd be a good tribute for your friend, though. Still full. His favorite. Strategic reserve. No touching. How come? Por qué no puedes tocar una reserva estratégica, va? Guess no man cave's complete without some of those, huh? He said they're collectibles. They don't print them anymore. It's definitely why they're up there, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that, that's why. <laughs> Basketball signed by Dante Gonzalez. He was from Haywood, too. Everyone here shot hoops. Dante ran circles around him. 
I think he might have been the first kid to ditch the Valentinos. Like Jackie? Mm hmm They both wanted more out of life. Dante's captain of the NC blackouts now. <laughs> Jackie loved to pump iron, didn't he? He called it his form of meditation. He used to say barbells are the best listeners. They understand all your problems and never give you gonk advice. <laughs> Gotta be hanging here since 2020. Love to poke around engines. He was 15 when he first got on a bike. Knowing him, it is a miracle he never wiped out. Jack, pure and simple. Well, you got something for your ofrenda, but we could look around a little more. Oh, Jackie, Is that a, a mandala? Mm hmm. Oh, it's a long story. Hey. You all right? I'm so much better than all right. I once told Jackie he should sweep all the dark energy out of this place. A sand mandala would do the trick, for example. He told me that out of sand he'd build a castle, a home, the Wells family hideout, stronghold, something. I guess you made a bigger impression than you thought. I guess I did. It's beautiful. It's hideous. But it's also the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. And an aquarium? They used to be tacos. And taco was? Miss Fish. A dwarf shark. Like, Minnie. Sounds like a mighty expensive fish. <laughs> oh, I don't think he bought it. Jackie's favorite tequila. It's still sealed. It's his lucky charm. One of the first bottles ever made by Jesus de Abajo. The founder of Sensan Tequila. Only a hundred of them left in the world. All owned by the one percent. How did Jackie get this one? Some shriveled abuela in Mexico sold it to him. Told him de Abajo had stolen her recipe. Taking this. Yeah, perfect for Jackie. Leather belt? Sort of a memento. His dad's. He used to beat both Jackie and his mom with it. Until one day, Jackie fought back. Kicked his butt. Told him he'd kill him next time. Old man was hospitalized, and then he left. Why did he hold on to it? In case his dad ever comes back. Beat him with it. Be Jackie's dad. Old school ganger. Valentinos, of course. Did you meet him? No, I only ever heard about him. But he didn't exactly inspire many fond memories. Nice still. Still his money. Okay. Oh, well, it's what it is. <clears throat> Yeah. 
Ich. Where are you going? Actually, V, I think I'll stay a while. Say bye to him here. Mama Wells wouldn't want me there anyway. What happened between you two? What's the beef? Let's just say she didn't see me as daughter-in-law material. What did she have against you? That my name wasn't Camila and I wasn't Jackie's ex-output. Camila was Mama Wells' favorite. Right. You gotta come, Misty. Got a right to be there. I'd rather not get in Mama Wells' way. It's for family. You were family to him. I guess you're right. Thanks, V. So, mm -hmm. shall we go? You ever thought you might leave Night City? Sure. Once upon a time, I even tried. Seriously? Meaning... Packed my bags and hopped on a plane? To Nepal. Thought I'd stay there. After a week, I realized I couldn't live without the traffic outside my window and my neighbors hollering. You're here. We're about to start. Sit down, please. Hey, V. Oh, Victor. I thank you all for coming today. I'm not going to tell you what kind of man my son was or lament about how much I miss him. Instead, I'll tell you a story. When he was about 19 years old, Jackie was in the Valentinos. They were at war with Malstrom back then. I get a call from the hospital. They tell me he got shot three times, just by the heart. He was conscious when I get there. So many tubes coming out of him. He looked like a, like a pulpo, like an octopus or something. He tell me, he said, No te preocupes, mama. Look, I'm bulletproof. Nothing bad will ever happen to me. And when I go, he take off his Valentino's ring. He swear he won't need it anymore. But he was not scared. He just didn't want me to worry. <laughs> Descansa en paz, mi hijo. En paz o pache. Among the membership of the Night City Devils Boxing Club, we had this saying. Make your best friends among the fighters who knock you out cold. And it's true. Jackie's arm was a cannon. No one's ever hit me as hard. <laughs> I can still almost feel it. Twelve rounds, buddy. Me mandó Camporta. Lamenta no estar aquí. Todavía le quedan cuatro años que cumplir. Me pidió que leyera esto. Recuerdo cuando Jackie se nos unió. Era un niño fuerte. Cuando decía que iba a hacer algo, cumplía. Tenía olor, ol, 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 honor. Podría haber llegado lejos. Mis condolencias a la familia. Que descanse en paz. Anyone else? I, uh... 
I often think back to the first time me and Jack met. It feels like it happened a century ago. At another time, in another place. Jackie saved my life. And then, years later in Night City, he saved it again. At a time when I thought I'd lost absolutely everything. I found my own freedom then. But it would not have happened without him. Jackie Wells. The best friend you could ask for. Loyal to a fault. Once he set his mind on something, he was ready to die to achieve it. He... He once told me, Chica, the one thing we can't do is be afraid of others. For his loved ones, he'd sacrifice his life without hesitation. But most importantly, Jackie loved life and had no fear. Heart on his sleeve, he, he didn't overthink things, he just went for it. Thought he was bulletproof and that he'd become legend at the afterlife. And ultimately, he did what he set out to do. Shit in the shoes of some powerful people. If he's watching, bet just about now he's flipping them all the bird. go to war as a boy you have a great illusion of immortality other people get killed not you then when you are badly wounded the first time you lose that illusion rest easy Jum. i would like to say a toast or mi hijo Thank you for your kind words, V. I'm glad you're here. It was a beautiful ofrenda we gave him. Why am I talking to a bartender? <clears throat> Poured you another? For Jaquito? Poor. For Jackie. Amen, sister. Who the hell is Pepe? Weird being here without Jackie. Can't shake the feeling I'm gonna turn around and see him sitting at the bar in his favorite spot where he always used to sit. Campos all torn up. Says he feels like he lost one. Hey, you! Have a drink with us, hmm? To Wells? All right, why not? To Wells! Rest in peace. Think we might know each other. Gustavo Orta. V. Yeah, I've heard about you. Well, heartfelt condolences, friend. From me, Campo, and all the Valentinos. Thank you. How'd you meet Jackie? We started out together. In the Valentinos? No, in the fucking Bible book club. I got only good memories of him. Rest easy up there, brother. Good for now. Thanks. See? You gotta know when to stop. Nah, give me a break. All right, let's go. How do I... No. 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 How do I change quests? Uh, 
с удовольствием с What the fucking god there was <sighs> Sucks to meet like this, huh? Farewells aren't that bad once you get used to them. Have you gotten used to them? When you get to my age, friends don't come and go. Just mostly go. Jackie Wells. A proud son of Haywood. I should mingle, Vic. Sure. See you later, V. Lupe's been handling the loss pretty good. She's a strong woman. A lot of people come today. Even that putica Jackie was messing around with. Damn you, Mama Wells. <clears throat> we'll have a talk. Here to say goodbye to one of your own, Padre. I'm here to say goodbye to a good man. Jackie, did you know him well? I remember the day his mother brought him into this world. The day his father left. The day he took you into his home. Yes, V. I knew him quite well. So, Padre, you think Jackie's looking down upon us from up there? I believe he has met God, stood before him. That's it? I don't know if God left the meeting happy, but I'm pretty certain Jackie did. Yeah, nice. How are things in the streets? This is not the place to conduct business. Have some respect. I'm gonna move on. Go with God. Her name is Misty. What? Misty. She was very important to him. Do you understand? Go. Invite her along for dinner. That's the least she deserves. Do you know what? You're a good woman. Jackie would want you to have these. <laughs> Are you sure? Jackie'd kill me if I got so much as a scratch on it. So don't get any scratches on it. Thank you. I'll take such good care of it. Cuídate, be.
Hey. You all right? Yeah. I think I'm just still in that garage, mentally. I just need a sec. See, that is here. Or Jackie's bar. 